Austin. Where's the label? In the table. Him? Where's the label? In the table. Everybody, where's the label? In the table. Labels, units, what goes where? We're going to find out by experimenting with paper aeroplanes to see which flies the furthest. Here are the results. In an experiment, the thing we change is called the independent variable, and that's normally found in the first column of a results table. For us, the independent variable is the plane. On a graph, the independent variable goes on the x-axis. You can copy the title and the units from your results table straight onto your graph. The y-axis is for the dependent variable, the thing you measured. For us, that was the distance the planes traveled. In a results table, the dependent variable is normally the second column, and it often has repeat readings as well. Just like before, we can copy the label and the unit from the results table straight onto the graph. The units go in brackets. And for the labels, remember... Everybody, where's the label? In the table! Perfect. That'll be sorted.